Hey everyone, Tac1421 here with another Black Ops 2 gameplay commentary. Today, I don't really have any topic in general, but just wanted to do a commentary. You know, every time, every once in a while, you just have that urge to do a commentary, but you don't really have any general topic in mind. So I'm just kind of jumping on here, talking about the gameplay, talking about some thoughts and stuff like that. I'll get into my class setup. This is actually one of my favorite, favorite class setups in the game. And hopefully I can show a picture of some kind on screen, maybe in the, the I don't know, where, where there's space, I guess, but I'll figure that out. But uh, basically the, the primary gun to this class is the MSMC, which is an amazing primary gun, and it doesn't really need too many attachments to be a very really good gun. Uh, you can you can really get away with maybe just using one attachment. I'm using I think the laser sight right here, and that helps your accuracy. And the the damage on this gun is pretty good. The um, range is is decent. Uh, what what it lacks in is the accuracy from other submachine guns. So if you put the laser sight on, helps the accuracy out, and then the, the gun becomes uh, pretty darn good. So uh, that's that's it's really nice. It's it's definitely one of my favorite uh, primary guns in the game. Definitely my favorite submachine gun for sure. And I am progressing it up. I actually prestiged it once. This was a, this gameplay was a while ago. It's a kill confirmed gameplay. I'm not exactly sure how my team does, but I think I do pretty well myself. I did fast forward a little bit because kill confirmed in this game is is into a hundred. Uh, points, I guess you can say, 100 confirms, which is a lot, and it goes, usually takes the entire time limit, or close to it, so I kind of had to cut it down a little bit, because I still am a little sick, so I don't want to commentate for a full 10 minutes, plus that kind of loses viewers' attentions when you have too, too long of a commentary, and I, yeah, I didn't want to do that, so, uh, my, my kill streaks are the normal kill streaks that I've pretty much been using the entire time that I've been playing this game, that's the UAV, which a lot of people are running, and then the Hunter Killer, which, again, a lot of people are running, it's pretty easy to get kills with this thing, as you can see right there, and then the Care Package, which I barely don't get, actually, I do get my Care Package, never mind, uh, Care Package, yeah, so, if you get the Hunter Killer, and you get a kill with it, you just have to wait a little, you know, it's only 25 more points for the hunter, uh, from the hunter killer to the care package, so if you just wait and until your hunter killer kills someone, which normally happens all the time, or sometimes you actually get both of them at the same time, which is actually usually what ends up happening, uh, then uh, things work out very nicely, and you, uh, you, you can get pretty good, you know, uh, stuff from the care package so as as many of you know it's, it's a little gamble but like the worst you can get is UAV which helps out your teammates so that's that's I think I like using the care package plus you you can restart your kill streaks over again and, and uh, just generally you know get more stuff I, I like to run around the map as best as possible I don't like to you know go through my kill streaks and stuff and you know I don't I don't want to worry about that so I generally try to keep stuff on that I can run around with. Uh, my secondary gun is the crossbow, which you can see here. I get some pretty nice kills in this game with the crossbow, uh, but this this gameplay I wasn't too advanced with the crossbow. This is, I, I mean, I was this this was a pretty long this game was pretty long ago. So, um, but I'm using that crossbow, which I believe I'm at level five right now. And I did prestige. I'll get into that in another video. I want to talk about fully talk about prestiging and stuff like that. My thoughts on prestiging and weapon prestiging and stuff like that. But uh, I won't get into it too much depth here. But basically, um, the crossbow only goes up to level six, I believe, and I'm at level five currently. And it's really tough to level up the crossbow. But I really, uh, I really want to level that up because I want to try the. Uh, Tribolt on that, which is like the level six uh, unlock, and I, I can't wait to use that. I think it's going to be amazing for it. But um, uh, overall, the crossbow is a really great gun. I have a crossbow gameplay, or I was just running around with the crossbow primarily. Every once in a while, I had to use my primary because that's the only way that you can really uh, get stuff from Scavenger, uh, which is why I love this class so much. It works well. It, it works so good with everything. Basically, um, I'll, I'll talk about my class further in detail. Uh, th this class is primarily based around using your um, using your equipment slash your crossbow to get kills, and then you have a, a really good submachine gun that 
comes into play that you can uh, get non-equipment kills, non-explosive kills is the better word for it. So then you can run over to the scavenger pack and replenish your C4s, uh, your, also your uh, crossbow. From, so you have the crossbow for long range and then the submachine gun for pretty much everything else. And again, I wasn't too advanced with the crossbow, but I have gotten pretty darn good with it, I must say, because I've been using it a lot. And the RC car right here, I just kept completely trapped, which is kind of funny. I thought that was funny. Um, but, but yeah, it's, it's pretty much that. So yeah, this class, I definitely recommend trying it out. Again, I'll, I'll have it on screen some way, I hope, uh, to show everyone kind of what's going on and uh, what my thoughts are, because... Um, you know, I, I've done pretty well with this class. It's it's a tough it's, Black Ops Two is a tough game to play. Don't get me wrong, because you die pretty quickly. It's it's a lot different from all the Call of Duties, but it's in a, in a good way, I think. And I'm just trying to you know adapt to it, get and uh, get uh, adjusted to the game style and stuff like that. Because again, it's pretty difficult to uh, get the hang of. So I'm I'm trying to do my best. But you can see here, I'm I'm doing pretty darn good in this gameplay. And uh, I don't I don't really know who I was playing with. I think it, it might have been Amp. I'm not really sure. I might have just been playing by myself because we're losing so badly. And Amp and I uh, go after confirms pretty pretty crazily, where we we pretty much try to win every game that we play. We're more objective players than we are KD players, but we also usually have a pretty good KD in all the games. Uh, even though in this one I I don't have that very that very good KD so far. Um, in this game, but uh, anyways, uh, this game is going to come to a close eventually, so I'll start wrapping this one down a little bit. Uh, my question for everyone is, how do you like this game so far? Uh, how, how do you like the crossbow, too? That's, that's a, uh, something I really wanted to ask people, because I love this crossbow, and uh, it's, it's definitely an amazing, amazing gun. So, also, um, what kind of gameplays do you want to see from me? Do you want to see you know gun game, kill confirm, capture the flag? Uh, that's pretty much all I play. Is capture the flag, kill confirmed. I do some team deathmatch here and there, multi-team, um, but I could really mix it up, do whatever. So let me know. This one's coming to a close. We actually win this one. Wow, I I, I guess I got the things mixed up. So uh, we win this one. I go 78 and or uh, 37. Or, wow. Okay, I go 38 and seven. I hope everyone enjoyed this and have a fantastic day, everyone. Peace.